Bobby and Susan were on a school bus with their teacher, Mr. Parks, and their classmates. It was a day for a field trip to Pleasant Grove Park. They were going to meet with a forest ranger and have a picnic by the Rivanna River. Everyone was excited. When they arrived at Pleasant Grove Park, they saw Ranger Sally from the local forestry service waiting for them. Standing next to her was a big owl dressed in green pants and a hat, hiking shoes, and a backpack. Bobby really liked the red feather in his hat and the whistle around his neck. Ranger Sally introduced him as Woodsy Owl. Hi, said Woodsy. I'm here to tell you how you can help take care of our land as we walk down to the Rivanna River. The teacher told the class to pick a partner to walk with along the trail that led to the river. Ranger Sally and Woodsy led the way. But along the way, they saw soda cans, plastic cups, and bags, as well as other garbage that had been left behind by careless hikers. Woodsy turned to the children and said, Do you see this trash and garbage along this trail? We need to take care of nature if we're going to enjoy it. We should always leave the forest as we found it. Woodsy pulled some big paper bags from his backpack and held them out to the children. Will you help lend a hand? Care for the land? said Woodsy. Everyone agreed. He told the children to collect any trash or garbage they saw along the trail and to put it into the bag. Mr. Parks helped too. Woodsy said, Remember, if we all work together, we can help clean up our land and water. Then the world will be a healthier and nicer place for all of us to live in. When they came to the river, they saw plastic bags that were caught on logs in the water. Woodsy flew over to the logs and removed the plastic bags. He told the children that they were dangerous for things that lived in the water. They can get caught in them and die. After they had picked up all of the trash, they had a nice clean place to enjoy their picnic. Woodsy told them about all the many ways that they could reduce, reuse, and recycle their trash, and how each way would leave the earth a better and safer place. Ranger Sally and Woodsy Owl thanked the teacher and children for coming and for being so helpful. Billy asked if Woodsy would blow his whistle for them. Sure, said Woodsy. He blew the whistle so hard that the children had to cover their ears. Help Woodsy spread the word. Come on, never, never be a dirty bird. bird. No matter where you go, you can let some people know to give a hoot. Don't pull. Hello boys and girls. Today I'm going to sketch Woodsy the Owl for you. And I hope this will help you inspire you a little bit with your poster that you'll soon be making. Woodsy, I like to start with his hat. I'm going to take um, and just sort of figure out how large do I want Woodsy. I want him to fit on my, totally on my paper, but you're going to make a poster with maybe many things in it like trees and bushes and um, park benches and animals. So um, this is just to give you an idea of Woodsy himself. I start with his hat, and his hat starts off with a triangle, sort of a, like that. His hat is the type of hat that Robin Hood wears, if you've ever seen uh, Robin Hood drawn or in a movie or a cartoon. So this is the bottom part of his hat, the brim of his hat. He always has a red feather in his hat, so we'll go ahead and put that red feather in next before I put the rest of the green hat on. On your poster, the wording on your poster that's important to put on is lend a hand, care for the land. 
we all lend a hand and care for the land, our world will be a beautiful, stay a beautiful place. Lend a hand, care for the land. So there's this hat. Um, I draw his eyes next, the, or the, his face, where his eyes are going to be. And when I do that, it's almost like a, a big heart. See the, the heart shape there? And then he, he's an owl, so he has feathers and We make his face feathery. He can have some feathers here on his chin. Let's put his beak in. I'll put that in right here, right underneath this peak of the heart. I'll put his beak. Woodsy says, reduce, reuse, and recycle. Important to be able to help keep everything clean. Okay, owls have really large eyes, so let's give him big eyes. There's one. Woodsy always has a shirt on that has a collar. So we'll give him a collar here and a collar here on his shirt. Yes. Usually has short sleeves. him a belt and oh, have him put it prop his leg up here. for him. And the Woodsy's message is to reduce, reuse, and recycle. We can reduce by just not buying so much. And we can reuse by taking, maybe taking a um, cloth bag to the grocery store instead of uh, using the plastic bags. And if we do get the plastic bags, we could um, use them maybe for something else before we throw them away. Woodsy is all feathers, so his hands are really e and arms are very easy to draw. 
We'll put a stick in this hand over here. walking stick. One thing Woodsy always has is a backpack on his back. So the straps would come around. He has that backpack to carry maybe you have bags to put things in. When you go to the woods or you go on a hike, you want to make sure that Whatever you take in, you can carry out with you. So take a little bag along to put all the trash in and leave the forest nice and clean. Here's his backpack back here, I'm making his backpack, backpack blue. So Woodsy has green pants. I'll fill those in. But you might want to show him planting a tree, washing, maybe washing a wall that maybe someone painted or drew on. Um, let's put some a little bit of color in his face. Let's give him, I'm gonna make this part yellow for him. I keep thinking his feathers up here should be yellow. And I think when you look in the books, the story books, you'll see that he is. His shirt is almost always white. Green pants, backpack, and always has a red feather in that cap. Now boys and girls, I know that you can do much better than this on your poster. And so Make your art teacher proud and your and feel a sense of accomplishment yourself with what you've been able to create. So there is my Woodsy. I think I want to give him a little bit of just a touch, touch of blue in his eyes. That's what I want to do. Here we go. There you go. There's Woodsy the Owl. I wish you, um, I wish you well on your poster that you're going to make. And I know you'll all do a good job. Remember, with the wording on that poster, it is lend a hand and care for the land. And there is Woodsy Owl. Thank you.